Um, Master Chef, like every season, especially this one, is always a wild ride because we start with such a large number of home cooks and then we start to whittle them down. And I think the moments that thrill me the most, we spend a lot of time with these home cooks. We spend a lot of time with them one-on-one, -on -one, but we also spend a lot of time observing them, observing the way they think when they're in the pantry shopping for ingredients and how they think about technique and watching them from closely but from afar. It's always thrilling to me to see a cook that I see great potential in that maybe doesn't see great potential in themselves really start to catch on and really have like a breakthrough moment. It's usually through a dish that they're, they themselves aren't even sure of and they come out of like the tasting just like punching and swinging and when they finally like find that moment, when they find their groove, there could not be a more thrilling moment. It always bums me out when someone like trips up and falls, especially those that have really, really, really great potential. It's kind of the nature of like, honestly, the culinary industry in general, especially in the MasterChef kitchen. But those are like the greatest moments for me as a judge, as a mentor, as someone that's really invested in these home cooks.